Hello guys and welcome to my channel and today we are going to be playing Soda Dungeon. So I want to give a shout out to Father Killer who support me on Patreon so thank you so much. If you guys want to help support me on Patreon in helping me make better quality videos, put more content on my channel, just overall support me, the link will be in the description below. Now I'm going to pick a comment from my last video. Uh, the comment I'm picking is from Seto who says I'm only at Dimension 3 highest zone of 205 I think I've had the game since uh, last year at some point but I have only played it for about 10 hours so yeah it's a type of game I either hop on once a day and do a few rounds or two then hop off or have it playing in the background while I'm playing some other game yes this is a game that you can just leave on to do its own little thing uh, so yeah thank you very much for commenting on my videos uh, I have actually had a load of people actually ask me about why I'm redoing this series but the only reason why I wanted to even do this series or clicker heroes is because you know on discord a load of people keep asking me to redo the series or start it back up again so that's the only reason why i've started soda dungeon back up is because you guys had picked it out of the two that i've been requested to play again so that's why i've done it now in this episode i am going to i don't know is it ascend or i don't know going to this activate the portal and go to the next part so we're gonna have some fun with this so are you sure you want to activate the portal absolutely lootly so the game will reset you will lose all your gold equipment items and so does premium purchases can however you will receive unique and permanent treasures whenever you reset so do I want to do, okay, not going to the next dimension, the first thing I'm going to do is, if you're going to do this, uh, try and get your, get all the tables and also all the kitchen stuff, uh, and then what you're going to want to do is before you actually go to the next dimension, we're going to turn this off, so we're going to press auto equipped nether, and then we're going to go into it, so, because uh, I want to get uh, the... Uh, dinner boys and it's just easier if before you actually go to the next dimension to turn your equipment off so you know what I should do that <laughs> oh gosh okay okay um yeah man we're doing it okay we're doing it we're doing it Okay, uh, I'm not even going to try and, and uh, talk that. Okay, so. Oh, sorry, I always forget which languages are used in this section of the universe. Ahem. <laughs> Greetings, traveller. Who or what I am is not important right now, but know this. Your work is appreciated. As a gesture of my gratitude, I would like to present you with a relic. Yes, those very same relics that your realm has searched for since the dawn of time. Up here all along. How silly. Anyway, choose wisely. Okay, so do I want more health? Do I want more strength? Or do I want more MP? I think I'm going to choose strength. Now you can pick whichever you want. You want. It's, it's pretty much like Pokemon. Uh... Like, you you got three to choose. I would pick Cauldron Bubble for your first, but either the health or the strength is entirely up to you, so we're going to choose that. Oh, fudge. Oh, fudge. I forgot to exchange my gold into essence before I think and liquidated all my... Oh, you know what? Screw it. Screw it. Oh, damn it. Excellent. I have one more gift for you as well. Yes, that's the soda junkie, uh, which we will be upgrading. And now, friend, your destination approaches. We will meet again. Someday. Okay, welcome to the next dimension. Okay, so we are in dimension two. I was kind of confusing it last time. Make use of the relics to ascend the dungeon quicker. 
Uh, use a new icon in the upper right if you want information on your relics. New treasures are way beyond dungeon level 100. Okay, so... <clears throat> We have two. So this is going to be our first one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to level this up to six. And then I'm going to level this up as much as I possibly can. Because I know this actually uh, does for all of my guys. So I'm going to level that up to 20. And then we got some dinner boys. Okay, so the ones with the food on the table, if you... Uh, the soda junkies with the uh, standing behind the food on the table those are have a chance to actually become a dinner boy so we're gonna go do that we're gonna do that and then we're gonna uh, refresh the tavern okay we got a dinner boy there dinner boy there okay we got a soda junkie there which we don't want okay we don't want that one we don't want that one oh my gosh oh okay dinner boy okay Okay, so now that we've done that, I'm going to go back to Thingy. We're going to go always because I want uh, the forks now uh, to do its job. So we'll speak to the wizard. Hello there. I had a feeling you'd be stopping by. Be on the lookout for Essence as you explore the dungeon. It's very powerful. You'll know it when you find it. Yeah, I've already got some. By the way, about the, that whole dimension nonsense... I'm not sure anyone else around here would understand it very well. We'll make it our little secret, okay? I do not trust the wizard at all. I do not trust the wizard. Okay, so we're going to go into here. Heard of the magic clock. It can speed up your uh, adventuring to earn your, your, your treasure twice as fast. Try to power powerful... Okay, so it's going to allow me to try the magic clock for... Uh, 15 dungeon runs, which is going to be fantastic. Okay, so. Okay, we want to earn an extra 10% gold. So we'll just go in to level 1. Yes! Okay, uh, enemies now have a chance to drop in essence. Look for enemies with a strange glow around them. Use it to power up your relics. Okay, so uh, anyone that's purple is got a, will drop a relic. So we'll put auto on. Come on, we can do it. We can do it if we be angry with. <laughs> okay, so you know, you know what the issue is with the, them giving you like uh, fifteen dungeon runs in order to do the magic clock. Is the issue with that is because you know unless you're able to actually get far into it. You know, instead of being able to only do, like, uh, 30 levels in, like, 15 runs, you know, you're going to be screwed, and then you're going to want to do it. So, I'm going to try and actually, gr because, obviously, I'm having to uh, record this first part. I'm having to record this first part before I actually go away tomorrow. So, I'll be playing it while I'm going away, as, as well as idle skinning. And what I'll probably do, as well, is... Um, you know, do this first half, try and grind as much as I possibly can. I'm going to try and get the magic clock uh, and the all sight as well, so that I can see the enemy's um, uh, health and also I can speed through these because it's going to take forever. As you can see, it's going quicker than it was on my first game or, or my first video, but obviously it'll be nice, although it costs like 500 mil uh, in order to do that. So I'm going to have to try and grind quite some a lot and I can only grind up to like level 199 before I have to stop. Uh, so I'm going to have to use the banker quite a lot. Uh, the banker is how I got quite a lot of money anyway, so you know. Boom! Boom! Okay. So we're on dinner boys and we, you know, are smashing it to be honest. This is why I like the dinner boys, because the forks coming in quite handy. Uh, very, very handy, actually. So, we're just waiting. Okay, so, I'm <laughs> already... Okay, so, I, I'm going to be dying soon. Okay. So, we're just going to wait till we die, and then I'm going to come out. 
and then I'll probably uh, grind for the next couple of days then when I come back make a video uh, killing the 200 boss uh, yeah, make a video killing the 200 boss and then from the next episode what I'll probably do is do a couple of runs for you guys as well instead of having to kind of cancel out everything I do between. Um, and the reason why I'm not doing it on this, okay, no. So the reason why I'm not going to be doing it on this one is because obviously, oh, I've earned five essence, uh, is because obviously I'm going away and obviously... Because I'm going away, uh, I won't be able to record so much on my phone because then, you know, it takes up a whole lot of space. So I promise from the next video that I do, I will do a couple of bronze uh, quicken for you guys uh, in between this. So what I'll do is I'll come back in a couple of days, uh, which <laughs> will be instantly for you guys. So I'll see you in a bit. And we are back with Soda Dungeon. So I've been away. Uh, I've come back. I've uh, did a video yesterday on idle scaling, and I decided today I'm going to be doing uh, Soda Dungeon. I still have to do a thumbnail for this, so it won't be out for another couple of hours or so, uh, depending on how long that takes. But anyway, I've been playing this game for a couple of days, trying to get money, trying to get essence, and as you can see, I've got 1.4k essence at the moment. And then we got this pink thing that I haven't spoken to because I wanted to show you guys on screen so we're going to do that now uh, so Fab uh, Fabulo uh, says hello I hail from the layer of despair I take it you're the, the one responsible for killing all these monsters they are sent down to me where they are subjected to my copious intellect and creativity it's been Every bit of frilling, but we're starting to run out of room. Any chance you could take a break from your onslaught of carnage to help us out? Uh, surely a manageable task for someone who what I can only describe as an insatiable bloodlust. Sorry, I don't mean to be rude. Work has just been rough lately. What with the extra monsters and everything. Fair warning, they are stronger, more resilient and generally unhappy about their fate. I will speak no more of the wonders down below. It, it, it is best you see it for yourself. Okay, so the layer of spare is packed with a uh, denser array of tougher enemies. You might also find some strange and powerful items if you look hard enough. Uh, progressing the layer of the spares is uh, limited by progress in, in the main dungeon. Good luck. Okay, so I'm not going to go into the layer of despair because I want to actually get past uh, to the third dimension. So we're going to kill the... Last dun 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 boss on uh, thingy. So we're gonna do that. Uh, do you want to warp to level 191? Yes, I do. I want to spend 190 gold. Was it 191 gold or whatever it was? Okay, so we're gonna just let this do it itself. I've got a knight that'll open everything, although I don't really need him anymore. Uh, not if I'm doing just 10 levels. Uh, we have a knight that will allow us to go through the right uh, fork in the road. Um, and then we got... Uh, oh, okay. So, we got a bonus. I, I just want to warp. Uh, so, I've got every one of my guys um, being able to go away without uh, being kind of thingy so the top of the layer draws near alexandra i suppose you're not amateurs after all prepare yourselves well that was fun okay dun, dun, dun. damn you all was that it oh my gosh was that it i was expecting a whole like array of uh, words there but no nah. Nah, okay. So, okay. Their job complete, your remaining party members congratulate each other and part ways, okay. Speak to the wizard if you want to advance the game. Okay, so, pretty much that's it for this episode. In the next episode, I'll be going through the Dimension 3. Uh, again, uh, I'll try and remember to... <laughs> I'll try and remember to actually kill the... Uh, um, 
to liquidate my stuff and stuff like that so you know uh but yeah that's it for this episode like i said next episode i'll try and do a few couple of runs for you guys as well but because i've been away i haven't been able to do that in this video but anyway i hope you enjoyed the video uh if you do like it uh like subscribe to my channel if you want more content like this and yeah uh i'll see you all soon Ta -ra.